Alright, it's time to head up the hill and see how that goes. Of course, our arm is broken, it's gonna be a little more difficult. But, <laughs> maybe. Depends on what all is there. Oh, these are dead bodies. Oh, well, never mind. Oh, uh, we'll burned through like one or two fertilizer already today, so. <laughs> we'll definitely need a, the awesome, uh. Man, I, it's nice to know that you're in the area of a nest, but boy, it's freaky. It gives you a heart attack. Just a second. <laughs> Alright, uh. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's that the wilds, the wilds keep spawning the coastal basin coming out at me. I'm gonna, what's that? Oh no, 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 it'll knock me out. Uh, I'm gonna run out of fertilizer fast. I'm gonna sit on the toilet a little bit today and fill those all the way up. Definitely gonna need some more explants so I can spread out the uh, number of shots going as well and kill things faster. Oh, also make it less likely. Oh, there's a dinosaur over there. What is it? Is that a Rex? No, Armagosaurus. Armagosaurus, okay. This is going to be a lot faster than... Hey, there's someone else's base right there. <laughs> this will be a lot faster than having to, uh... Run all the way back down there in each trip. Just run into this spot for each trip. Okay. Let's see the set up. Doesn't need to be much of anything. What is that? Oh, crap. There's a dinosaur up here now. Alright, well, there's metal there. I'm safe and put it here. It's a little bit part of the block, but it'll be fine. It's gonna be bigger than that. <laughs> I'll get some put more pestle in there as well. And we'll put a crafting station here too. So we can make spark powder up here. Take this stuff back down. Alright. But this mod does not give <laughs> anywhere. Uh, everything's heavy. <laughs> you just can't. <laughs> yeah. So it can take a while to do stuff. Oh no, there's a Quetzal over here now. I just saw it flying down. Hopefully it's not toward my base. Uh, I think my base is right there. It just flew down right here. Toward that other person's base, I think. Kind of behind that pillar. It wraps around, but I don't think it wraps on that far. I don't think it's on that side of the way. That's the ocean side. But yeah, there's a Quetzal right there. I don't know what it's doing. Hopefully it doesn't come this way. Fire supposedly attracts the bigger things like Quetzals. And they hunt you. <laughs> hey, well, I did. What is this? My stat, only mine wipe tonic. Huh. Drink this tonic to forget everything you've learned except your ingrams. Oh, nice. That's good. Let's convert a mine wipe into it. Alright, cool. Alright. Forget you kind of search for the S plus walls or the. If you want to use the S plus stuff. I'm not sure how if you use S plus and without S plus, I don't know how well it lines up. Oh, sweet! I had just enough. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's not lighting up. Oh, well. That's okay. I don't think a wild dino can hit through there. I think a, a aim modder could, but, you know, I don't have to worry about that, so. I could have sworn someone walking by. I was in there. <laughs> this stuff up. I wonder how far I can hear someone walking. I can hear someone down there walking. Watch somebody punching out the cliff. Oh! <laughs> Hello! Hey! How you doing? Long time no see! <laughs> oh, did you ever get your How's egg? How's it going? <laughs> no, absolutely. I gave up and took my happy ass to bed. <laughs> okay. I did get a berry egg earlier, though, so that was exciting. Oh, nice! Nice, yeah. I've been. I have to go find me one of those. They are gonna be very important later on. Yeah, there's like a um uh there's a nesting area that spawned like right next to my base. So eventually I had to deal with the uh the two forty that spawned, so that wasn't super fun, but I made a little trap outside my base, so it's working real well. Nice. I saw your oh, we were walking by earlier and saw your plants just absolutely decimate like a Bigfoot. That yeah. was really cool. Yeah, I'm using them to farm hide. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, that's that's the move. I uh, I saw Toast build like a little mini trap next to his base, and so I took inspo. We I mean, might actually be able to see my. Yeah, if you see, if you just take a little peek, sees right there. Uh, my home sweet home. Uh, ah. still working on upgrading from a thatch house, but you know, in due time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, big Quetzal flew right by your base earlier, so. <laughs> 
Is it that one right there? Oh, you can see a Quetzal? Uh, I do not see a Quetzal. Oh, okay, yeah. You see a Quetzal? It flew right past you, right above your base, and went down toward the ocean there. <laughs> oh, that's horrifying. I think it stayed. I got a, um... Go ahead. No, go ahead. Oh, I was going to say, um, back when uh, I was on the beach, kind of further down there, a Quetzal definitely paid a visit to my base and definitely wrecked it, so. <laughs> yeah. Um, Hippo is actually funny enough. Hippo is right kind of below my cliff edge, and they're in chat right now. It's like, we should make zip lines between all three of our bases. <laughs> it would be very, very cool. Yeah. I don't know if you saw it, though. There's a really nice crystal deposit kind of a little ways up the hill there. Yeah, yeah, I actually went and got a bunch of crystal from the Skull um, Rock yesterday. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm about to make a canoe so I can go and see the world. Um, <laughs> maybe get around a little easier. Yeah. He... Are you going to go on the on the egg hunt raids, whatever that uh, a few of us are doing? Uh, maybe. It's storming here. Oh, I'm afraid to get very far from my base. Oh, honestly, that's fair. Well, we'll have to make some egg runs soon, since we're neighbors and everything. Part All of right. the HOA agreement. <laughs> the, um, the egg runs for a giga, right? Uh, yeah. I, um, I, I, I will not be keeping the egg. I feel that's a lot of responsibility, but I think Demea was going to try to get a, uh, a good breeding pair going, so, which would be honestly pretty clutch. Nice. When's it? Uh, Okay, there's also an RG nesting ground right kind of like a little bit up the beach and back into the forest that I was going to try to go by later. But if you want to go by and try to get the egg, please go. I'll go for if it. The, uh, the, the egg nest, they changed like it seems like it. Yesterday there was Enki's bomb base. Today there was uh, RG's bomb base. So it just seems to be changing. Yeah, that's true. At least it's nice that it keeps rotating. So like something new every day you don't have to travel too far you know every now and then something yeah of that. Uh, well Kinda anyways good luck with your day <laughs> thank you i'm too. gonna go die to some gigas <laughs> <laughs> okay so there's a, a juvenile doe up here look at that level one a superior kibble so i'm gonna go back and get some superior kibble and i'm gonna come back and tame this guy uh, I mean, it'd be nice to get rocks with him. Uh, it'd be amazing to get, uh, metal with him, though, so still need Anki, but... I wonder if Anki takes a beer go. Well, I think they took exceptional. I'm not sure. Anyway, I'll need the metal to make the, uh, subtle gems with. We're gonna need metal hide fiber. Crystal oil? Yeah, I got all that back to the base. Okay, so we'll head back to the base and make that so we can tame him, and then hopefully it only takes... Oh, I don't have a refrigerator though. My kibble's gonna start spoiling. Oh well, let's just do it. The RG nest turned into a Kintro nest. No, they still got the RG sound. Oh, Kintro's after something. Go Kintro. Unless you're after player, then run player. Who is this? Small. Whatever. I'll take it. They ma oh, they're mad about it. Oh, he's fast. Holy crap, he's fast. He's gonna knock me out before I get to base. <laughs> you see the dust coming up? Look at him go. Look at that dust. Oh, crap. <laughs> Look at him go. Alright. <laughs> Holy crap. You see, just as high. <laughs> that was so fast. All right, now this thing is kind of cool. We have a reward vault. We open it here, and we have access to stuff. This is where I got my tech gear. General shop has some cool stuff in it. Um, nothing great or amazing, but some stuff. This is what I've been saving up for. Whoa! They added more kibble. Never mind. How much does it cost? Three hundred. Oh. Save up for 300 and tame something else. I mean, the weds are nice and all. 
boy, but this takes... Oh, I don't even have enough, so it doesn't matter. Did that cost 350? I'll just save up for that. I'll tame something with this. Yeah, so the longer I'm up here, the more stuff is spawning, which makes me think the server has set up for uh, hibernation, so that if an area is not rendered, it doesn't spawn stuff. So, now we have a Kinsher up here, which is going to become problematic. I think. They're usually aggressive. Yeah, here we go. So, let's get his attention. Do not want to fight? Oh, that's weird. Kinsher's usually fight. Oh, they're normally aggressive. I guess not on this... Oh, he's on our nest. I guess he's just gonna be run away. I mean, <laughs> I expected him to aggro me. I was all ready for that. Oh, here he comes. Okay, here we go. Did we get him to jump off? No. Hoping if I ran around that fast enough to jump off. Hey, you. Uh oh. Alright, you gonna follow me? Follow me down, come on. Follow me down, yeah! There we go. Oh, you know what? I made a bed. Put a nest with a smithy and then... That's <laughs> it in the smithy! Oh, instead of blazing it! Oh, now I'm gonna run all the way back up there. That's okay, I got the kincher away from the metal. <laughs> oh, I'm silly. Oh, what a waste of time. Alright. <laughs> silly mistakes. Alright, so we got our first nest working. Should let us hatch the Anki and the uh, Pterodon here. So we're going to be taking care of them for a little while until they're at least they're 10%, right? Hand feeding them so they don't starve to death once they're 10%. I'll feed them with the trough and we'll be good to go. I can head back out and adventure some more, but yeah, that's where we're at. We got metal. I got like uh, 3,000 metal smelting in the mountains. Got these guys going here. I think we're well on our way. Um, unfortunately, with the Quetzals and Argies able to come down in here, I think I'm going to need to build up above my Fabricator a little bit and throw on some actual uh, auto turrets, see, just in case something comes over the wall, uh, so they can kill that. I can probably get some more X-Plants to put them in here. X-Plants kind of hard to get right now, because <laughs> the Dianicas are guarding the, the plants, and you got to steal them from the Therizinos two at a time, so yeah. Uh, that's the plan for now. I think we're well on our way here.